Hey guys, I have a small TJ Maxx haul for you. Let's see what we got here. Smashbook. I've <laughs> I just bought two, but TJ Maxx has them on clearance for four fifty, so that's a good deal. That Michaels, I believe they're like twelve, and then I got them on sale at Walmart for nine, and then I just seen them for four fifty. So. And actually, I don't have this one. This one's pretty neat. Tasty style, it's called. And inside, it's like all, well, there's food-related stuff. You got a big ice cream there. <laughs> so I thought this was really cute to put some recipes in, actually. Packed in sardines. So I got that. And... I actually went there to see if I could find some hairspray. I've been using the same hairspray since I was, uh, let me see. When did I start using hairspray? Maybe when I was like 12? So I've been using the same one and it's just, uh, it's not helping my hair now that I'm older. So I guess that's why, I, I don't know. <laughs> but I found this and I thought I'd give this a try. By Derm Organic Fast Dry Shape and Spray. So I don't with anti fade extracts. Look at that. <laughs> so I don't know if it's any good or not. It has that argan oil stuff in it. Makes your hair shiny, and it has like nothing in it. So it's vegan. No animal testing. No artificial preservatives. Sulfate free, gluten free, sodium chloride, salt, paraben, dyes, everything. It's just free of everything. It's probably freaking nine, ten dollar water in a can stuff. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I paid ten bucks for it. So it wasn't cheap. But I wanted to try it because I don't know. I'm having some issues with my hair lately. And my skin has always been awful, but it seems worse. So I'm just wondering if maybe if I try some new products that don't have any of the stuff in it, maybe maybe it will help my skin and my hair. I'm going to give it a try and see what happens. But I got this, and then I needed um, a hair mask because the one that I have has all that stuff in it. So I found this one, this brand I've never heard of, and they had um, body wash, conditioner, shampoo. What else? I'm not sure, I, but they have a whole line of stuff. And this is the hair repair mask. So, like sometimes in the morning, I'll wash my hair and put a deep conditioner in it and wrap it up in one of those turby twist things and I'll just leave it in there till like the afternoon or something. I do that like every other day. So this I wanted to try because this is another one with none of that stuff in it. From what I've heard, this whole sulfate and this stuff kind of dries your hair out, so I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to give it a try, though. So it's Argan Oil Ultimate Repair Hair Mask. It was $12.99, which wasn't too bad. It looks pretty neat. Can you guys see the little bead things in it? And it smells... Oh, my goodness, it smells so freaking good. They had two, and I really wanted to get them both, but I only got the one. I'll give it a try. And then I found this. This is a facial moisturizer, and I've never tried this brand before either, so I don't know. I don't know if it's any good. It takes, like, a serious moisturizer for my skin. This was 8 bucks, and again, it has none of that. Can you guys even see? Hold on. Let me turn the light off. Is that too dark? I don't know, it might be. <laughs> well, we'll see, all right. So it has none of any of that stuff in it. So you know, harsh detergents, um, just all that stuff, fragrances, sulfate. I think that maybe, oh, there we go, now you can see it. I think that maybe stuff like that, well, it had, I think that it would have something to do with 
the way that my skin is. So I'm going to give it a try going this way. So we got that. It's just a face moisturizer. And then I needed a new face mask because the one that I use, again, has all that stuff in it. So this is by this brand. And this is Skin Renewal Clay Mask. Absorbs dirt, impurities, as reduces pores. Sounds good to me. Here it is. So it has none of that stuff in it again. And that was $7.99. So I'm gonna open this up and see what it looks like actually. All right, it's in a tube. Oh, there you have it. Hmm, smells good. So I'll give all these a try and let you guys know if any of them are any good. And the last thing I got from TJ Maxx was this cute new dog bed. <laughs> in hopes that maybe they would lay off the couch and use the bed. They've had beds before. Bo usually takes them and tears them up, but I thought this one was shaped differently and it's heavier, so maybe he'll leave it alone. And it's by Happy Tails. <laughs> so it's really cute. It was 40 bucks. I thought that was cheap because dog beds can get pricey. But that was my TJ Maxx haul. Um, yeah, I'll see you later. <laughs> Bye guys.